Hello friends, now we see the problem number 5 which is also based on substitution method of chapter limits. The problem number 5 is limit x tends to pi by 3 root 3 minus tan x upon pi minus 3x. Now let's see the solution. L equal to limit x tends to pi by 3 root 3 minus tan x upon pi minus 3x. Now here we substitute limit as x equal to pi by 3. So the next step will be root 3 minus tan of pi by 3 upon pi minus 3 into pi by 3. That equal to root 3 minus tan pi by 3 gives root 3 upon pi minus in the denominator we cancel 3 3 so we get pi minus pi. So again this is of the form root 3 minus root 3 gives 0 upon pi minus pi gives 0 so which is of the form 0 by 0. So it means here we have to use the substitution method technique for solving such a kind of problem. So the next step will be put x is equal to limit. So in present case we have limit pi by 3 plus h as x tend to pi by 3 and h tend to 0. The next step will be L is equal to limit h 10 to 0 root 3 minus tan whenever x we write pi by 3 plus h totally divide by pi minus 3 in bracket pi by 3 plus h. So that equal to limit h tends to 0. Now this root 3 I can write root 3 upon 1 minus. Now tan pi by 3 plus h we apply tan in bracket a plus b formula that gives us tan a plus tan b upon 1 minus tan a into tan b. So in present case tan of pi by 3 plus h gives tan pi by 3 plus tan h upon 1 minus tan pi by 3 into tan h and that totally divide by pi minus now minus 3 into pi by 3 so that gives pi minus 3 into h that gives minus 3h so is equal to limit h tends to 0 root 3 upon 1 minus now tan pi by 3 gives root 3 plus tan h upon 1 minus tan pi by 3 gives root 3 into tan h upon in the denominator we cancel plus pi minus pi so we left with minus 3h now cross multiplying on numerator we get limit h tends to 0 root 3 in bracket 1 minus root 3 into tan h minus 1 in bracket root 3 plus tan h and whole thing divide by 1 minus root 3 tan h 
into minus 3h. <coughs> so is equal to limit h tends to 0. Now in the numerator root 3 into 1 gives root 3 minus root 3 into root 3 tan h gives 3 tan h minus 1 into root 3 again we get minus root 3 and minus 1 into tan h we get minus tan h whole thing divide by 1 minus root 3 tan h into minus 3h so that equal to limit h tends to 0 now plus root 3 and minus root 3 we cancel then minus 3 tan h and minus tan h so that gives minus 4 tan h in the numerator upon 1 minus root 3 tan h into minus 3h now here we cancel minus sign from numerator and denominator and the constant term that is 4 by 3 we take outside the limit so the next step will be 4 upon 3 into limit h tends to 0 tan h upon h in the numerator whole thing divide by again limit h tends to 0 1 minus root 3 into tan h in the denominator so on simplifying further we get 4 by 3 into 1 in the numerator and in the denominator we have 1 minus root 3 into tan 0. So 4 by 3 into 1 gives 4 by 3 upon 1 minus root 3 into tan 0 gives 0. So on further simplifying we get 4 by 3 in the numerator and 1 in the denominator which gives us 4 upon 3. So this is a required solution for the given problem. Thank you.